Good morning, everybody. Dry and quiet conditions on the webcams this morning, but we have a pretty good cluster of some showers and thunderstorms firing just outside of our viewing area. I'll show you that momentarily. The heat and humidity going to ramp up. They're not out there yet. It feels fine, but by this afternoon, you really feel it. Heat index values between 100 and 105 today and tomorrow. Heat advisory has already been issued for a lot of our areas, so make sure to stay hydrated and find a way to stay cool. Live Doppler radar, you're saying, where's all that rain you guys talked about over the last few days? Well, it is firing but just outside of our Fox 17 viewing area. So let's go to a little bit wider perspective. There's a warm front sitting right in here. And sometimes those storms fire right along the front and then dive in here. That's what our forecast models showed for the last few days. But then when I came in and looked at the latest run, it's still showing it. And then I looked at radar and said, well, this isn't happening. So this is all firing and it's pretty extensive too. Some lightning, some heavy rain just outside of our viewing area and it's dropping to the southeast. That's what it looks like is going to continue to be the case. I can't compare completely rule out a shower thunderstorm, especially north and east of GR, but right now, based on radar trends, it looks like we're going to stay dry. Our uh, dew point temperatures are comfortable. They're in the upper 50s to around the 60 degree mark here. Remember, that's a measure of moisture in the air. You go across the lake on the other side of the warm front, wow, they're in the 70s. That's some oppressive stuff. The warm front's going to lift through, and that's where those dew point temperatures are going to soar for us through the afternoon hours and stick around for the next few days. So it's going to really be hot and sticky later today, and we'll get in on some sunshine too. Temperature is not a big deal right now. We don't have the hot or the heat and the stickiness out there right now. We're in the upper 60s to around the 70 degree mark. Pull back to a wider perspective. Look at that ribbon of the heat that's already coming into Chicago, Milwaukee and points to the south and west. So those are temperatures and some of these places have excessive heat warnings in effect that are going to feel more like 110 to 115 degrees. We won't be to that extreme, but it is going to be warm. I still can't rule out a shower thunderstorm mainly to the north and northeast of Grand Rapids. So I still have the chance of some scattered showers and thunderstorms in there, but based on radar trends, we're not seeing anything. Otherwise, we're partly cloudy to partly sunny, hot, humid. Heat index values between 98 and 105 with a temperature up around 90. It's going to be breezy today, too, with a south to southwest wind at 10 to 20 miles per hour. Those winds are driving a high beach hazard risk from Holland northward and then a moderate beach hazard risk. These areas see, seeing three to five foot waves today. These will be about two to four feet. Those are your Lake Michigan water temperatures, small craft advisories out for you boaters with those south to southwest winds at 15 to 25 knots. This is what the setup looks like 9 o'clock this morning. The latest forecast model shows the warm front lifting through but with zero rain for us. So we'll see if that continues to hold true. But that's what the radar trends have been showing. Uh, you can see the system's going to move on through the area, but there'll be a couple of lows across our area. So we'll see a lot of dry time, but there could still be a shower thunderstorm that crops up tomorrow. And then again, uh, Friday night into Saturday as the next system will come on by here. Uh, here is that next cold front, and that's the one that's going to come in here Friday night into Saturday. There's much cooler, more comfortable air behind that that will set us up nicely for the weekend with comfortable temperatures. We're on a marginal uh, threat for severe weather for today, especially along and east of 131 and south of Grand Rapids for tomorrow. Hail and wind would be the primary threats. Here are the future feels like temperatures. Not a big deal this morning, but these ramp up into triple digit heat uh, later today. They'll wane a little bit as we go through the overnight hours with the setting of the sun and then they ramp right back up tomorrow. So that's where we're going here over the next couple of days. So we're about 90 degrees today with maybe a scattered shower thunderstorm north and northeast of Grand Rapids. A chance of a shower thunderstorm tomorrow. Humid 91 but triple digit heat remains in play. A little bit cooler for Friday but still humid and then that cold front goes through and by Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Wow what a difference a few days will make. It'll like Mother Nature flip the switch to cool temperatures with highs in the 70s for the weekend and beyond. That's weather. We check traffic now at 718.